Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight here with a special shout out to all the crew in base. And today we're going to do a little bit of a channel update. It's especially for the Fallout fans, but we'll cover everything. First off, for the GTA fans, we should have racing on Sundays through, oh, I don't know, May. With the videos I've already got loaded. We've done a lot of racing here, and it's, uh, we got a lot of racing. As a matter of fact, I think the last videos that are uploading are still showing me racing in the entity. And, uh, definitely rocking the RE7B for a while now. So we'll see, we'll see how that goes. You should be seeing more of the new yellow car as things go by. I've got a bunch of CEO in pajamas videos loaded, but I'm not sure how much longer that series is gonna go. Still not sure if it's working or not. We're gonna have to see. Comment in the description below if you wanna see more CEO in pajamas on Mayhem Mondays. The one video series where it seems like the videos are better if the missions go awry. TF2, I'm kind of on hiatus. I'll get back to it at some point, although I'm planning on folding the TF2 Tuesday videos into the Mayhem Monday videos. I think Monday is going to be the place for shoot 'em up stuff. Which brings us to Fallout 4. Now, Fallout 4, I have been playing along and I've been doing a lot of, you know, building settlements and doing side missions. And I've pretty much stayed away from the main mission, the main quest line, simply because the ending sucks so badly. And by that I mean, no matter what ending you choose, you are forced into some sort of betrayal. That makes for great writing, but it's not as satisfying as one might hope if you're not into betrayal. But what I've done is I sat down with myself and I said, Self, I think our fans need to see the main quest resolved at some point here. So I plowed through a bunch of railroad quests that would get knocked off if, you know, the main quest was complete, or at least that was my perception of what would have been going on. And then plowed through the main quest line, through the end of the main quest line, although I did kind of take the short method to get there. If you go with the other factions, there are a lot of other side missions that you can do, but it's an interesting thing. If you've ever played the Stanley Parable, there's a lot of things that go on there about game theory, and it's, it's an analysis of game theory, and it's what do you want? Like, you can, you can finish the Stanley Parable in about five minutes if you want, and just get to the exit, solve the problem, and get out. If you just want to see sunshine again and be happy, it's very easy. If you want to explore the game, it takes a good bit longer. Oddly enough, I started out on the path that I was going with this based on what I wanted the post- main quest game to look like as I continued things along. But as I went through everything, it actually felt like this is what my character would do. Now, as a result of this, I could have six months easily of Fallout Fridays. Just one video every Friday for the, through the half of the year. And I thought to myself, at that point, is the game still going to be relevant? I, I really don't know. It seems strange to say it, but it's actually starting to get into the realm of being an old game. And so that these videos would have a modicum of relevancy, I've decided to upload them, well, not all at once, but I'm thinking starting with this Fallout Friday, we will do one every day until they're out there, all of them. Should take a little over a month, and of course if I keep playing it, I'll keep adding to that. And once we get through all of those, then... That's going to be it for Fallout Fridays. Then any Fallout videos that I do, and I probably still will do Fallout videos, will be put on Mayhem Mondays. That's right. So we'll mix those in with the CEO in pajamas and eventually with, I believe, the TF2 videos too. Anything that involves a shotgun in some way or another will go on Mondays. And to be perfectly honest, I can't guarantee there's always going to be a Mayhem Monday video or even a Racing Sunday video because... Well, basically, I'm sharing with you whatever I'm gaming with. And if I start getting really into something else, then that's what I'm going to be... That's what I'm going to do well. That's what I'm going to be fresh with. That's what's going to get you the best commentaries. That's what's going to get you the best videos. This doesn't mean that in a month I won't find myself completely jonesing for TF2 or GTA or whatever and start just going on a tear making videos. That could happen. But I'm afraid I'm getting in a rut here. I want to do more creative stuff with this and I want to do different things. And again, this channel, I'm not... I don't have the expectation of becoming PewDiePie here, okay? I don't think... This isn't my job. I have a day job. This is a hobby. And so the fact that I'm sharing my hobby with you, I think is a good thing. I think, hope you think it's a good thing. And I'm just going to keep hobbying and doing the gaming kind of stuff that I do and hopefully you find it entertaining. But in summary, you can expect at least a full month of Fallout videos every day for that month. 
sprinkled in with a whole bunch of GTA and whatever else I decide to upload. And of course, as always, remember that if you're playing a video game, odds are you're doing it so that you can do something that you cannot do in real life. So please, kids, don't try this at home. And on that note, this is The Black Knight. Have a great night. Okay, so I guess, I guess we just have a cow on the roof now. That's like a thing. <laughs>